Hey, welcome back to Overkill Reviews. I'm Sam Dunn. It hasn't been that long since I've been back in the chair in the banger hangar. Why? Well, I insisted on reviewing this record. That is the sound of the brand new record from extreme metal supergroup Ultimus. Their new album is called Something Wicked Marches In and was released last week on Season of Mist Records. But before I get into the review, let's give a little background on how this all came together. So the story goes something like this. Runa Erickson, ex-Mayhem, current or noir guitarist, has a handful of riffs lying around. So what does he do? He calls up. Flo Mornier, drummer from Cryptopsy, bit of a player, let's put a band together. They start working on some stuff, then they realize we're missing a vocalist. Who's on speed dial? David Vincent, of course, of morbid angel fame, and thus forms Ultimus. And then the process of making it is sort of this long and convoluted process. First, they're in Georgetown, USA, working on some material. They go to Runa's home studio in Portugal, starts to solidify. They go back over to Texas to visit with David in his home studio. And at last, they end up in Oregon Studios in the middle of nowhere, England, to record the record. And that finally gets us to the release. So, my first impression of Something Wicked marches in is that this is a pretty lean affair. Firstly, it clocks in at under 39 minutes. And secondly, given it's an extreme metal power trio, it's a pretty lean sounding album. There's not a ton of layering in the guitars. It's very direct. It's got elements of that kind of dissonant, atmospheric riffing that Runa is known for, and of course, mixed with that definitive death metal growl of David Vincent. And I think in the drum department, Flo being the fucking machine that he is, it gives it a very distinctive modern technical feel. And as I got deeper into the record, one thing started to become very clear. David Vincent just might be extreme metal vocal god. This guy has really delivered on this record, and I haven't seen him growl like this in a long, long time. Don't know if it was a conscious effort to put his vocals right up front in the mix, but man, this is a fantastic vocal performance from David and really reminded me that he truly is one of the extreme metal greats. Other thing I wanna say about this record too is it's fucking fast. There is some really quick guitar and double bass work on this album. My buddy Paul Harrington characterized Runa's playing like a hummingbird floating across the fretboard, and I thought that was a pretty apt description. Although I will say that my favorite tracks on this album is when they go more mid-paced. Songs like Mono Lilith and The Closer Marching On, to me, give the sound a little bit more room to breathe, and they can create some pretty heavy, crunching, mid-paced riffs when they really want to. But ultimately, I think the best thing about this record is that it's better than the sum of its parts. And I think that's often what so-called supergroups fail to do. Ultimus has its own identity. It doesn't just sound like a Mayhem guitarist, a Cryptopsy drummer, and a Morbid Angel vocalist on a record. It actually sounds like a real legit band with its own character and its own sound. I do think that Something Wicked Marches In does have a lot to offer, not to mention a woodcut album cover. I'm a metalhead. I've got to like woodcuts. I really like the album cover. But if pressed, there's a couple of things I'm not crazy about with this record. One, Where's the bass? And I'm not just saying that because I'm a bass player and I'm the guy that's supposed to say that, but come on, David Vincent is in his own right a formidable bass player. Not that it has to be higher in the mix, but it's not really adding anything to the sound. 
and maybe it's leaner than it needs to be. That bass break on Suffocation on Altars of Madness, one of the best that's ever been done. I want to hear something like that just with a bigger, more modern production. But enough about the bass. I know you guys are already commenting enough about the fucking bass. I guess the other criticism would be, apart from the two tracks I mentioned, there's not a lot of standout tracks on this album. There's nine songs, it kind of blows by 38 plus minutes, and it's sort of like, it feels like one song. Maybe not a bad thing, I don't know, but there were moments where I was like, I wanted a tune that really fucking knocked it out of the park. So my verdict is, this is a great fucking extreme. I'm swearing a lot this way. <laughs> so my verdict, Something Wicked Marches In is a great extreme metal album and probably my favorite of the year so far. Great riffing from Runa, Flo's drumming is incredible. And as I mentioned, Vincent's vocals are the best I've heard in a long time. This is a band. This has a sound, it has its own character. All I gotta say is, Let's see it on the road, Ultimus. I'm giving this four out of five skulls on Overkill Reviews. But before I go, I do want to give some shout outs. It's a pretty busy week in metal. Of course, Devin Townsend, brand new album Empath is out on Inside Out Music. Sorry, Devin, loved Ultimus too much. Had to review that one this week. And of course, looking forward to New Possessed. That song is pretty killer, as well as Abbott and tons more metal to come in 2019. See you next time.